M0FXB, welcome to my channel, Zygu X6100 with the R1 CBU firmware version 0.16 and we have FT8 Decode live without a PC, so that's pretty cool, you can see it all coming through, the different core signs, the signal strength, all everything's there, I, I think that's excellent. It's also added a quick menu function, so let's come out of this app here. We, well, while we're on this, we've got SWR scan. Let's do that. Run. So we're now running an SWR scan. This is my 9 to 1 balance with a 20 meter wire. It's not too bad. Actually, I haven't run the tuner yet. So let's run the tuner. I don't know if that'll make any difference. Uh, so we'll come out, push run. And we'll go to the tuner. Do some tuning and then we'll run it again. Yeah. It improved it's not amazing but it worked so that's pretty cool let's push this button here uh, it's come out first like so and then we'll go to settings and he's also added uh, some memory th things so let's not seeing it in this window oh in that first window we're seeing that you can change the date you've got this brightness timeout thing which we can change it's not a touch screen, of course. <laughs> uh, and then you've got the hours, minutes, and seconds. So there's some sort of date and time there as well. And let's push the general button again. If we keep pressing this first one, eventually we get to memories. Of course, there's lots and lots of different functions that have been added in this. Check them out. I'm just going to go to memories. There you are. Memory, you've got a group. So let's go to the first one. Yeah, memory one so you can bring one in just by pressing it or you can load you can save one yeah so that's one I did earlier let's change that frequency then we'll hold it hold it we saved it let's go to set two save a different one okay save then we'll just push number one look number two you get the idea very easy to save memories now according to the download document it says volume encoder in dialog windows is a repair, incorrect filter in SWR scan, a repair added 500 kHz span for SWR scan, memory press and hold and load, and then FT8 decoder, let's go back to that because that was fun, so push app, FT8, of course you need to set USB just by the mode button at the top, and we'll go to 7074, USB and just give it a minute Should start to decode quite quickly Yeah, you've got that dimmer thing now as well There you go, it's starting to get something. What does that say? RX 854. I haven't set the clock anyway, so I'm not sure if that's the clock Just now when I put this on it works straight away 7074 USB VFOA Alright, bye for now. Check it out. 73, all the best.